Hello and welcome to another video. Today we're going to learn about Windows shortcuts that we can use to aid us and assist us uh, when writing documents, uh, typing in things online on the internet, and just uh, overall use of the computer. So, in this example, I'm going to open up Microsoft Word. I'm going to open up my Hello World document. And I'll give you an example of a few shortcuts uh, that we're going to be going over, which are uh, Control A, Control X, Control C, Control V, and Control Z. So you would hold Control on the keyboard and then press A or X or C or V or, or whatever uh, uh, key to do a shortcut uh, to, to perform a task. So for example, let's say I have Hello World, and let's say I have a list that goes uh, like 1, let's do like A, 2B, 3C, or D. 5e for example and we want to have like multiple copies of this list okay we want everything here and we want we want it to be copied like throughout the page for example if you want so what you would do is to select all or everything you do control a so that selects everything including the space we want to get rid of the space we just want the list okay so we can do control a and select everything that we have that we've written and now we want to copy it uh, and paste it. So we're going to hold Control and then hit C. So now it's copied. And then if we press Enter, get that out of here. Oops. We can press Control V, paste it. And we can do that as many times as we want. Control V, Control V. And you can make as many copies as you want. Okay. So this was too many copies. So I want to get rid of all of these. So I'm going to do Control A. And then I can hit either delete or backspace on the keyboard to get rid of everything. Uh, and since it was copied, it's uh, still in the computer's memory. It still remembers what it is. So if we do control V again, we can get it back where we started. Okay, so that comes in handy. If you just want to copy, uh, make multiple copies of the same thing over and over uh, in a document. But what if you want to take something out and like move it around? So let's say I want 4D instead of 2B. For example, or if I want if I want D uh, instead of uh, A, okay. So I could highlight D and hit Control X, and it'll cut that. So it's cut out. So now I can highlight A and do Control V, and I'll put the D over there instead. So that's how you can copy. So you can remove something, still have it uh, in the computer's memory as if you copied it, and then you can paste it somewhere else. So if I wanted to cut out World. Control X, I can put it in front of hello, control V. There's our world, now it says world hello. Um, so you can use that if you want to move certain things around, if you added something and you don't want to delete it, especially if it's like a huge paragraph. If you decide, hey, I don't want it at the conclusion, I want it in the beginning of my essay or whatever document, you can just select the whole thing uh, and cut it and then paste it somewhere else uh, rather than doing something like, uh, like copying, deleting. So like, for example, you could do like, How are you? You could also just copy this, paste it wherever you want, and then delete the last one. But the whole idea of shortcuts is to make things faster. So Control X could just do that with one keystroke rather than uh, two, for example. Um, so that's Control A, Control X, Control C, and Control V. Uh, the last one is Control Z. So that is to undo. So let's say I. I let's say I want to say I made like a typo. Like, how, how are you, sir? And I didn't mean to add sir. I wanted to add something else. You say Control Z, and it'll undo, and it'll go back to where it was. Another way of doing it is, and at least in Microsoft Word and most uh, Microsoft-based apps, like let's say Excel, PowerPoint, things like that, uh, up top next to the Save uh, icon, there should be uh, an arrow pointing to the left. That's to undo, and the arrow pointing. Uh, to the right is to redo. So now we went back to how are you, sir? And then I can undo that just like that if you prefer uh, clicking rather than using the keyboard. And the same goes for the shortcuts. So if I want to select all, I can just highlight everything. Uh, if I want to copy, let's say I want to copy how are you? Just highlight it, right click, and then we have the copy option. And let's say we press enter, we want to paste. Right click again, and then we have a few pasting options. We can uh, continue with the list, we can make a new list, we can just keep the text, and then it'll just paste it again. 
Um, if you want to cut, same thing, highlight it, first one is cut, and it'll cut it out, and then you can paste it, just like that. Okay, uh, if you guys have any questions, if there's anything else you'd like to see, uh, future videos, things of that nature, uh, let us know in the comments, or send us an email at questions at and we'll get to it. Have a nice one.